As a new game developer working with Unity, you're probably just learning about how to use the editor. Unity's play mode allows you to simulate gameplay within the Unity editor without building the full project. This makes it easy to quickly iterate on your code and develop projects faster. But if you're new to Unity, it can be easy to get stuck in play mode. You might also see a warning from Unity when you try to save your project in play mode. The normal warning you'll see will say, you must exit play mode to save the scene. In this video, I'll cover some details on play mode, what that error message means, and how to exit play mode. In Unity, play mode is a state in which the game is actively running within the Unity editor. This mode lets you interact with your game directly from the editor and test out your project. Since a full build can take anywhere from 15 seconds to a few minutes, this mode makes it comparatively easy to quickly develop and test new features without doing a full build. The error message, you must exit play mode to save the scene in Unity, occurs when you attempt to save changes to the scene while still in play mode. Unity prevents saving the scene during play mode. When you're in play mode, any changes that you make cannot be saved back to your original scene file. This makes it easy to make changes and adjust your project in play mode without having these changes affect your project. At the same time, it also makes it easy for you to lose any intentional changes that you did make. So always make sure that you've exited play mode before trying to make any concrete changes to your scene that you want to keep. Always remember to save your scene regularly to preserve your progress and avoid losing any changes to your project. I strongly recommend setting up a Git repo to help save and keep your work. If you've ever lost a paper for school, like if your dog ate it, imagine how you would feel if you lost your entire game. Not so good. So now I'll talk about how to exit play mode in Unity. When you're ready to exit play mode and return to the Unity editor, there are a few different methods you can use. You can use the toolbar, you can use the keyboard shortcut, or you can use the menu bar. I'll cover each one of these different options in turn. We'll start with using the toolbar. The most straightforward way to exit play mode is just to press the play button again. The play button is the same button that you press to enter play mode, the one on the top of the middle of the Unity editor. When you press this button, Unity will exit play mode and you'll be able to save your scene. The next one we'll cover is the keyboard shortcut. In my opinion, the easiest and quickest way to exit play mode is by using the keyboard shortcut. On Windows, just press Ctrl-P and Unity will exit play mode immediately. As a small tip, you can use Ctrl-Shift-P to toggle pause mode. You can use Ctrl-P to enter play mode as well. The final way is using the menu bar. In the Unity Editor's menu bar, click on Edit. Then look for the Play option. When you click on Play while in play mode, Unity will transition out of play mode. You can also use this option to enter play mode as well. You can customize the keyboard shortcut to exit play mode using Unity's preferences. Click on Edit, Shortcuts, then search for Edit slash Play. The default keyboard shortcut is Control p but you can set it to whatever you want. Unity's Play Mode is a valuable tool that lets you simulate your game from directly within the Unity editor. Knowing how to exit Play Mode is just as important as knowing how to get into Play Mode. That way you don't get stuck. In this video, we covered various methods to exit Play Mode, including using the toolbar button, using the keyboard shortcut, and accessing the menu bar option. With these different options, you should be able to exit Play Mode anytime you want. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it helped.